Right now, a party like no other is happening in Durango. We're talking snowdown, of course, and Devin Neely takes us there. Every, every part of it's fun. The, the parade's fun, all the events are fun, the people are great, costumes are great. For 37 years, Durangans enjoy the fun of snowdown. It was a cabin fever reliever, and it has grown over the years to be one of the largest winter celebrations in America. This five day steampunk themed festival kicked off Wednesday with a fashion show of do's and don'ts. But the question remains exactly what is steampunk? It's 1890s with the kick. It's the old Jules Verne, the old 20,000 leagues under the sea. It's uh, Wild Wild West. It's, uh, it's the Victorian era. Goggles, top hats, cogs, and gears dominated the attire. But Snowdown is about more than just dressing up and having fun. Well, that was part of the original missions, was to generate some economy in January, which was a very slow month. And it still is. Organizers expect more than 10,000 spectators for Friday's light parade and have more than 140 events lined up for the week. We have a chili cook off, we have a beer plunge where it's Five degrees outside and people jumping in a baby pool full of beer. We can't really so stay on TV. We're having fun, um, and that's the number one uh, tenet of Snowdown is to have fun. Happy Snowdown from Durango, Devin Neely, KOB Eyewitness News 4. That's definitely one of a kind, and if you want to join in all of that fun, we've got the full list of events right now on KOB.com for you. Just go there and click on four links. Any